Dude, where were you last night? Oh, you know, the usual. Watching old games from 2002 and weeping openly? <laughs> what? No, don't be silly. <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, where's Gary Roberts when you need him? Leafs lose 2 to nothing to the Florida Panthers, and there's been a few moments lately where I've said, you know what, that perfectly encapsulated the Leafs season. No, 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 no. This whole game was the Leafs season. Let's review. They outshoot their opponent by a mile, but they let in at least one bad goal, make at least one really bad play in the neutral zone, and let's not forget at least one power play goal, and that's the game. Been the same recipe for disaster all year, and you wonder if it's ever going to change. When they went on that nice winning stretch earlier in the season, there were three things you noticed about the team. Decent goaltending and a tighter defense. The forwards were all up in the goaltender's face, getting right in there and going to the net. And speaking of all up in your face, they all had mustaches. Like Hagman, what happened to the Hagstache, man? I don't know if a mustache makes you a better player, but it commands respect. Speaking of mustaches, let me tell you about a certain player. This certain player is a defenseman that's on on pace for 13 goals this season. He's also on pace for 37 points and he's a plus rating on the Leafs. He even led the Leafs with almost 26 minutes of ice time last game. Oh, and his contract's up at the end of the season. I am talking, of course, about Ian White. So let me ask you guys, is Ian White going to be a Leaf next year? Heck, is Ian White going to be a Leaf by the end of the year? And if he's not, how would you feel about that? And it seems like there's been nothing but bad news in Leafs Nation lately, but let's talk about some good news, namely Luke Shen and Carl Gunnarsson. Now Gunnarsson, say what you want about him, is playing way above expectations in his rookie season in the NHL, a season that a lot of people didn't even think he'd play in. And Luke Shen, I don't think you can say enough about how he's improved from the beginning of the season to now. And you know what? If, and it looks like when the Leafs don't make the playoffs, at very least you can say, well, at least the young guys are doing well. But that's it for this LFR. Add me to Leafspace Facebook and Twitter, and I'll see you next time. When they win, right?